Valeria is an underused bulb that produces a beautiful orange flower, very unique. Um, but one of the problems that gardeners have is the bulbs rot in the soil, so they don't last very long. People get frustrated with them. Uh, so we're going to look at a little trick to make them last longer. If you look at the bulbs from the top, they look kind of like a cinnamon roll, and they have openings inside here where water could get in and stand, and that's what contributes to the rotting. So we're going to use just sand, plain sand, and pack that in to the bulbs into those openings. And I'll do that for both of my bulbs. And this will just prevent water from standing inside of there. The other thing we're going to do that's rather unusual is plant our bulbs sideways. So rather than setting this up where any water that seeps through the sand will get in there, we're going to do it this way so that the water can drain out. Um, and then they go in just like any other bulb. Because these bulbs need to be planted about eight inches deep, I'm going to use a shovel to excavate a small hole. And remember to account for mulch when you're calculating the depth of your planting hole. I have a bit of a rocky soil here, but that's good. We want a very well-drained soil for our fritillary so that we have good drainage. And remember to put the fritillaria on end so that that opening is sideways. And you can even grab a handful of sand and pack that in along the side just to fill any openings. And go ahead and cover it back up with soil. So you want to find a sunny spot for these plants. They are sun loving. They'll reach a height of about 32 inches. And again, they need a very well drained soil and proper care to ensure that they endure in the garden. And again, Fritillaria need a nice sunny spot. They'll reach a height of about 32 inches and they need a very well drained soil so that they can endure in the garden. Mm -hmm.